Hey everyone, it's Yoslin and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this necklace. This necklace is from the series The Summer I Turned Pretty. It's a really popular series right now, so I decided that I would make the necklace that Belly wears in the show. So yeah, this is the necklace design that she wears in a lot of the episodes, and it's really easy to make, so if you want to learn how to make it, then just keep on watching. Okay, so the supplies you're going to need is five different colors of beads. These are the colored beads she has on her necklace. So we have a blue, black, yellow, pearl white and regular white. In case you want to know the size of these beads, this is the sizing. And you're also going to need elastic string. This is the one I got. And lastly, you're going to need a clasp. So I already had this one, but it's from Joanne's Craft Store and you can get a pack of them. All this applies is from Joanne's Craft Store. So now that you've seen everything you need to make this, let's get started. So I got this little tray so I can put the beads in. So for the beginning, I'm just going to mix all these up. I'm just going to pour some of these beads in here. This is kind of the part of the necklace that you don't really see because it's in the back. It's just going to be all of them mixed together. And then the last color. So now that we have all the colors mixed up, I'm going to get the string. And we are going to get some of this for the necklace. So I just got a random amount. So I didn't measure it or anything. But we're going to start off by tying this onto one end. That way the beads don't slide off when we add them on. I'm just going to knot this how you would do a regular knot. Pulling this under. I'm going to tie this three times. I'm going to tie this by putting the string through the loop. Going through this little loop that we made and tying it. I just want to make sure that the string is secure and that it's not going to fall off. And now we can cut off the excess string and now we can start our necklace. I'll start off by putting on the random beads. This is no specific order and I'll get back to you guys when I've added enough of them on and I can show you guys the next step. This is where I'm at. I added about 40 beads and I ended it off with a black bead. This is just them in a random order. I just randomly got them and put them on the necklace. But now we're going to start doing the actual pattern that her necklace has. So I'm going to go ahead and get these pearl white beads. You can do it a random pattern. Just make sure you end it off with a black bead. I'm going to put them on the necklace. And these are a bit bigger, so I'll probably do around 25 of these. I'm going to start adding them onto the necklace. added 25 of these pearl white beads. Now we're going to start with a new pattern. I'm going to go ahead and get the black beads. I'm just going to use the ones that I have here. And we're going to do two black beads, one pearl bead, two black beads, one pearl bead, two black beads, and one pearl bead. So we're just going to do it three times. So I'm going to go ahead and add on this bead. So there are the two beads. I'm going to add one of the white beads. So it's going to look like that. So I'm going to add two more black beads, then the pearl bead. And we're going to do it one more time. And then the last one. So your necklace should be looking something like this. So now that we've done this, we're going to add the black beads. We're going to do the same thing we did here, where it's just a lot of them in a row. So I'm going to put some of these here. And I'm going to add them on to the necklace. ended up adding on 22 of the black beads so we're going to repeat this pattern again and we're going to get one of the pearl beads and then we're going to do two of the black beads and then one pearl bead and instead of two black beads we're just going to do one this time and now we're going to do eight of the blue beads so i'm going to get them from here Now that we added these, we're going to go ahead and add the white bead. So I'm going to be going in with these ones. We're going to do the same thing we did here where we just added a whole bunch of the same color. Now I'm going to add these ones. So I added on the white beads and now I'm going to do two of these pearl ones. So now we're just going to add the yellow ones on and we are almost done with this necklace. I 
I added 15 of the yellow beads. And we're going to do this pattern again over here. So it's going to be the two black beads and the one pearl bead. And you're going to do that three times like it is here. Now that we've done this last pattern, we're going to go ahead and add these all random again, kind of like we did in the beginning, and this is going to be the final step for the pattern of this necklace. We're just going to add these randomly like you did over here. After the design we did, I just added 12 of the beads. I didn't do too many just because I don't want the necklace to be really long. So now we're gonna add the clasp so we can finish the necklace off. And we're gonna do a knot. So I'm just gonna put this through the necklace and I'm gonna make a knot. I'm gonna tighten it and I'll show you guys how I did that close up. I'm gonna put the string through the clasp, put the string through the loop and tighten it. I'm gonna do that two more times. And to finish it off, I'm just going to tie it like this. Make sure I tighten it. So I'm just going to cut off the excess string using my mini scissors. And then here we have the finished necklace. We've added the clasp on. And that is how you make this necklace. So yeah, that is this necklace all done. I have it on. As you guys can see, you can see all the different colors. Here we have the white. It is inspired by the necklace that she wears in the show. Her necklace, they never really like show it close up, but I just kind of tried making it look like the one that she always wears. All the supplies I got at Joanne's craft store. If you guys want to make this, that's where you can get the supplies at. Or you could get it at any other craft store. I'm pretty sure they'd have like similar beads. I watched all the episodes and I really liked the show. So yeah, that's why I made this necklace because I noticed she was wearing this beaded necklace a lot. And if you guys liked that show, then you can make the same necklace as her and have the same one. It's a really simple pattern. You don't have to be precise. Like if I said 25 beads, you could do 22 or 28. You don't have to use the same amount. It also depends on the size of your neck. So I did this one and this fits perfectly. I kind of didn't want it to be like too tight. You want it to be a little bit looser because that's how hers is. I just measured the necklace that I made in case you guys want to know how long it is. And this one is about 14 and a half inches in case you guys want to make yours a similar length or the same length. But yeah, that is how you make this necklace. It's really easy to make and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have watched this summer. I turned pretty. But that is it for today's video and if you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!